Once the customer is leaving uh, what he is doing traditionally with us, uh, we must uh, understand uh, exactly what are his uh, main concerns, his main uh, uh, interests outside when he's just uh, leaving us. Uh, so this is about big data. Okay, ETFs are growing, everybody knows that. But who are the benefactors? And what we've realized, the benefactors are these asset managers that have decided to express asset allocation views using ETFs instead of using individual securities. I got very confused. TP and I used to sit down and go, how can you look at this stock without knowing what the market's doing? Can't. Worse, how can you look at the stock without knowing what the futures are doing? And then even worse, where's my portfolio? How can I look at this stock, look at my positions, and try to determine what to do without knowing what's in my portfolio and what the market's doing? You've got to help them in a way that's going to be easy for them. You're there to get out of the way and facilitate great results. And that's the whole end game. I, I go on um, right when the market opens and I trade the futures and then trade the SPX and then I go hiking. And then I go volunteer with the city parks and rec and take people on tours and stuff like that. And I do take care of my family. That deep understanding of the customer context and then having executive confidence in the organization's ability to respond in as near to real time as possible at an appropriate cost to serve is where the next phase of competition will be forced.